Tom in Fredericton attracted attention on social media beforehand, but not nearly as much for the actual event. A little over a dozen people came out on February 14th to show their support for a cause, with only a few choosing to dance. The event took place in the atrium of the Student Union Building at the University of New Brunswick. The Valentine's Day flash mob was part of an international movement called One Billion Rising. It's an attempt to raise up against violence against women. Flash mob dances took place all around the world on or around Valentine's Day in an effort to start a revolution. It had been originally planned for Regent Mall. The location changed two days before due to liability issues, according to the organizer. Elizabeth Strange planned the event. She is a third year St. Thomas University student. The entire point of the movement was for it to be on or near Valentine's Day. So with a lot of people having Valentine's plans, it's kind of difficult to move around that. And that, just that there are so many changes with location and time because of different rules and whatnot. The Facebook event had 89 confirmed guests an hour before it was supposed to start. Debbie Jones was one of the people that did show up. Um, I came out uh, to support the initiative, mm -hmm. um, but I also came out to support a not-for-profit that I uh, do a lot of work for, and uh, we run into situations of women and violence all the time, um, so wanted to stand up and uh, have our voices heard. Although there weren't many there, it didn't stop anybody from dancing for a cause. For Stu Journalism, I'm Amanda Jess.